Mi Abaga joins Fela. Um, he becomes the second Nigerian musician to have a fan write an inspirational book in his honor. Um, Noel, Noel Michael Bucky, a fan of Nigerian rapper Mi, has written a book on the artist and dedicated it to his inspirational views on life as reflected in his song. Bucky took to Twitter to share an image of the book's cover while seeking Mi's permission to publish the book titled The Crowded Self, an, Explo an exposition of Mi Abaga's study on self-worth, Young Denzel. And of course, Mi has given him the permission. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I also saw a reply from Audu Mekore and he said something like, um, permission already granted. Yeah, so. Now, my question is, this book is already done, isn't it? Yeah. Mm, it's not published yet. But I'm saying it's but done. He, he yeah. it, it, the book it, yeah. is written already. Now, yeah. I've had a few authors approach me. They want to do a book on me. They ask particular questions. They want to know okay. my story. They we have flex, but it's okay. You know, yeah. no, oh, no, I'm just, no, I'm sorry, I'm just saying. No, 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 it's right. okay. So like, I'm, 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 a bit, I'm a bit, I'm a bit, I'm a bit not so um, enamored by this because you, if you don't, if you don't know Mi, if yeah. you didn't have a one-on-one -on -one with it's Mi, it's not his memoir. Well, a it's case about study of him. He said something about him, but again, at the end of the day, I, f I feel there should have been an interface between this author, this book writer, and Mi. And so you're giving him permission to write. I think I'll and at the end of the day, if if it's published and most of the things in there don't necessarily reflect who you are, then what goes? What happens? I would have expected that Mi would have been consulted, meet with this guy, tell your own story the way you want to tell it. And they it's know what to do. It's not a story. It's what? not a story. It's about his music. Yes, and that's, about it, but st that's it. About his, his music. His music from that has been in, that he has felt inspired him. This is not about <laughs> Mi no. and Mi's opinion no, no, no. about no, no. how he's inspired. No, it is the good thing I've, I have reached out MI, to Bucky MI, and hopefully he'll be on the is show. Mi. It's so. a reflection of Mi. <laughs> I get so where you're coming yeah, from. Yeah, we can't what separate I MI from his I, I think I had that feeling when I saw MI's response, permission granted only. It made me feel like, is it that you people have, you've had a conversation before bringing exactly. it to Twitter just to publicize it? Because I expected that you would say, okay, yes, I would love this, permission granted, but can we see just... You what might angle not necessarily are you saying? Saying? When I saw this thing, because yeah. I also love him, I, I because you know for Fela, whole album. I mean, I, that's what I'm going, going to say now. I went to Fela was own, dead when and this that's was what I'm happening. saying. It is possible for it to be done without the person influencing solely, like attaching his um, yeah. influence mm -hmm. onto the book. So there's nothing wrong with him not getting permission or involving Mi in the journey of writing the book before it's done. Because the person that we are comparing it to, that never happened. Not for any of the books, and there's about three of them. Yeah, so just because it, it never not, happened it doesn't, doesn't make it, it, doesn't make yeah, it but right. It doesn't mean you know, it's like necessary. Said, it's not, it's, Fela, it doesn't make it wrong Fela either. Is, Fela is dead. And again, whoever did that, I, I want to believe it, he also saw, he also met with Fela family. His kids are still have alive. To, is what I'm saying. Now, I'm just saying, if somebody wants to put out a book about me, regardless of whatever it is, my, my art, my art form, a biopic, my autobiography, it's only right. I think it's what it's done. You meet with the person and say, okay, I want to do this about you. Even if it's my music. And that's what? nice. You don't, even know, you don't even know where my source of inspiration comes from when we it comes care. to my music. We don't care. That's what the book is about. You know? Yeah, but you, <laughs> but you know M.I. has um, played a lot of role in the industry and he ha he's had a lot of beef as well in the industry and he's had how many albums now? So I think he's one of the artists that released I think two albums in one year or it three albums in one year. So I think just sitting back and looking at Ay, say Ay, <laughs> looking at Ay, his journey and everything, I think it's enough for a very creative person because to this guy is not just that they need. any yeah. writer. He's that's what he does for a living. So I think it's enough to create a concept and write something on Mi. He he said he's going to be on the Young Denzel movement and all that mm. alone makes yeah. a book. Yeah. So it's possible. The I just hope he does justice to it. Yeah. And I hope that Mi will not come out tomorrow and be saying this one is not true because you had the opportunity that's my to point, say. You know, I mean, because and the, I, I the young I, 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 Senzel, even, even if it's the wrong, there's nothing Senzel, wrong it's, with that. This is not MI's book. This yeah. is not MI's book. We're not going to go and get the truth from MI MI's book, written by somebody else. About MI. So people write about no. people all the time. You can't that's get it. your, your information and for most of from it, there. That's it. For most of it, the information either turns out a fallacy or an untruth. And that's not yeah. MI's problem. It's but okay. That's what Elsie just said. Let's hope by the end of the day, when this book finally comes out, Emma is not going to have some problem with some things that are written about him. For me, I don't want to take away from the fact that this is a big deal for Emma. Yeah, it's it a is. big mm. accolade, and I'm and I'm, I'm proud that somebody has done that for him because he deserves it. I'm not I'm not going to say he's the most recent, like you know, he's bringing out music back to back and he's relevant today. But I will put quality over 
quantity, quantity and say that he has produced very fine music that was rich in African culture, was a good rap. I'm not even a big rap fan, but I love his music. I cannot say that M.I. is a terrible artist or on any song or that he doesn't deserve this. So kudos to him and kudos to the person that brought this idea or initiative up. Mm. <laughs> 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 okay, I like that.